we have the opportunity to create a field of coherence because our presence, the reality of who we are is coherent and that's not only a statement of individual truth, it's a statement of collective truth. When we truly show up, you do and I do, inherent in that is, is coherence, a field of coherence. You might call it spiritual coherence to distinguish it from other kinds. It's a coherence of selfhood. The coherence doesn't spring out of the human level of things. In other words, it doesn't, it doesn't spring out of shared culture, shared religion, shared nationality, shared race, shared beliefs. That should be obvious enough, right? Like, nationality doesn't make you coherent. Apparently so. So, at every level, the human world doesn't create coherence by itself. No, coherence originates someplace else. We have to access that someplace else. If who we are as human beings has a continuum to the physical, the very outermost aspects of our existence, to the highest levels of our beingness, at the highest levels of our beingness is where the coherence originates. At that level, there is coherence. When we touch that level and express ourselves and embody who we are from that level, we are being present as ourselves in our world. That is full self-emergence. And then we're coherent. We're individually coherent, but we have at least a chance of being coherent together. And of course, it's more than a chance because what we know is it, when we really do it, it happens. We touch that field of coherence and we're sharing it together. And with coherence comes great love, affinity, we find out that it isn't a hostile universe. If you're looking to be of service to another person, aren't you seeking to help them come into some kind of coherence? You may not have used that word, but isn't that it? Some kind of internal coherence and then coherence with their world, energetically, consciously, vibrationally, a place of, of health and holism, Serve, being of service to another is figuring, you know, I have enough coherence myself, not just to sustain myself through a day, I have enough to lend some support to another person. Out of spiritual coherence in us as a human being and among us as human beings comes a right relationship with the planet upon which we live. We believe that out of spiritual coherence can come sight for the future, for an, a different future. You can see a positive future out of the eyes of spiritual coherence. When we're being spiritually coherent our, among ourselves and we're thinking about our world and we're thinking about what's unfolding, we can imagine wonderful things happen. 